Hold on, I gotta blow my nose real quick. With frequent weather changes comes flu season. And with the uncertain weather pattern in the Bowling Green area, many WKU students like Rachel Marcus had no choice but to fight through it. I woke up and felt like I was in the third person. I didn't feel like I was in my own body. Everything was slow. I had no energy. My head was throbbing and I could not breathe out of my nose. Nurse practitioner Lisa Grimes started noticing an outbreak of the flu about two weeks ago, and she doesn't see it slowing down anytime soon. The start of flu season has actually been going on for probably the past week or two especially. It seems like it's hit Bowling Green hard. I have seen three to four cases this week. A colleague of mine here at the Glasser Clinic has seen five cases this week. And with the influenza virus currently going around, Nurse Lisa says not to overlook a simple sneeze or cough. The symptoms of the flu are, it starts off with a runny nose, just generalized body aches, um, Fever can be up to 101. A lot of people who come in feel like they might have something else and it's actually the flu because it does have a fever with it. Although there is no cure-all for the flu, flu shot or not, there are multiple ways to keep the flu at bay. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention recommend hand washing and refer to it as a do-it-yourself vaccination and should not be replaced by hand sanitizer. Hand sanitizer is good, but it doesn't replace hand washing. Or you touch anything with your hands, please don't put it around your face because the flu is very easily airdrop transmitted. I'd say the worst part is the lack of energy because you don't feel like you can do anything. I couldn't go to the gym. I could barely make it to class without feeling totally drained of everything I had in me. You really don't want the flu. <coughs> For News Channel 12, I'm Katherine Gardner.